Okay, so what I have is this blower motor for the uh, AC evaporator um, heater core is hanging up on me like it. I mean, if I go to, to switch it, it'll run, but if I turn it off, it won't run again. You know, you got to kind of bang on it and it starts running. So, uh, you just took, I just took the two little 9mm bolts off. You know, they have these carriage bolts on the end over here. And um, I'm going to see what, what, what happens after that. Okay. So I took the bolts out. It looks like this thing, you can get your damn knife in here. And just kind of pry on it. And it'll, it'll separate. Okay. And just take that front plate off. That's all that is. I thought it was the bearing. That bearing looks really, really good. Okay, spin. So it's maybe the brushes. Oh, the pipe, the back plate fell off for me. See, in this back plate, it falls off. There's no special clips or anything. Thank goodness. And now we have the uh, other little bearing. That sucker's running good. So it's probably just going to be the brushes. So let's just get this thing separated. Okay, this this thing is just in it's in a magnetic case, magneto, whatever. And uh, you just take it out of there, you just push it out because it's the magnet is actually what's holding everything together. There's nothing, there's no more other clips. Oh, here come the brushes. Yeah, so those little brushes, you know, you just feed them back in with the uh, with the spring, you might have to use a little paper clip, just like when you're doing a start or something. Okay, you can see it's a little worn. So I'll probably just sand that down a little bit. And um, flip the brushes around and uh, away we go. Thank you. Okay, so I went to the hardware store, which luckily is by the truck stop. And uh, I just went and got like a little file, let's see. Just a little six inch slim taper single cut taper file because it's getting hung up. The brushes are getting hung up in here. So that's all I'm gonna do. I mean, just file that down because the brushes really can't be removed from the unit. Um, so I'm just gonna file this down, file the uh, brushes down and put it all back together. That's all I'm gonna use right there. Just file that little groove out of there uh, I don't want to get I want to stay where it's still copper you know and then I'll take another piece of sandpaper and just go around it you know to make it as round as possible and just you see how that groove is in there and that's where it's getting hung up that's it and then I'll just go and just wind my little brushes down they got plenty of um, The brushes still have plenty of meat on them, you know, and just, you know, you can just stretch the spring out a little bit to give it a little bit more uh, elasticity so that it pushes. But you see that groove that's in that damn section there. And, you know, in order to take the brushes off, I have to rewire it and get some new rivets. And I'm going to do all that. This works. It works. Great. That's the only thing wrong with it. Bearings are good. Spins free. I mean, it, it switches on and off, but, you know, it just hangs up right there. I already checked the the, um, the switch. It works. Uh, everything works on this thing. So, that's it. Just going to take a, my sandpaper, about some 80 grit, 80 core sandpaper, and take it in there. And then I bought, I think, some 100 and... Oh yeah, 120, and uh, you know, just to so it won't be so coarse, so that it'll slide. It won't. I'm not gonna, and that's it. And just put it back together, and then we'll try. We'll test it out. Okay, so here's a muscle minus the end result of sanding that down. Okay, and the, these brushes they were real easy to sand down. They were they weren't hard at all. I mean. That's the best I'm going to do on that because, look, I still got plenty of meat left on them, you know. 
so they came out really good another thing you want to clean up is this this spins inside that other magnetic piece so i shine that up a little bit those are kind of deep don't want to mess it up and you just blow it out with your blower so i'll put it together and see how it works well i got it back in uh it's working we're gonna see how how, uh, how long it stays working but as of right now it's working which is 